Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, hi, my name is Stephanie. I am a 29 year old Canadian living in Germany and I make videos about my life here in Germany. I'm not new and maybe have noticed that I haven't posted anything in the last two weeks. Sorry, it's just um, things have been really busy with work and I, we also did our German taxes for the first time. So we're doing a lot of work on that as well as our Canadian taxes, which is more complicated than I was used to doing it from abroad. And also I've just kind of been feeling like not, there's not much going on. We can't travel. We can't, we shouldn't really go outside so much um, because the pandemic is still quite bad here. So there hasn't been any, there hasn't been anything new to show you. Um, so that's the reason why, but behind the scenes, we've been working really hard at work, but also on our move. Um, so you may have seen our video where we announced that we're actually moving from our current city, Aachen, um, to Frankfurt. Um, we're moving this week and we're really, really excited to be moving. Um, it's, I really like Aachen and there's a lot of things I like about Aachen, which I'm going to tell you about today, but I excited for a change. Um, being in lockdown for so long, it's not like, you know, you can't go to places, you're really stuck here. So we've seen, we've seen what we wanted to see and now we're ready for something else. So really, really excited to be moving to a new city and uh, excited to show you that. We are taking over the apartment shortly. So in the next couple of vlogs, you'll be seeing like our moving vlogs, what that's like here, um, what our empty apartment is. I think next week I'll be able to give you an empty apartment tour, which I'm really excited about. And some furniture shopping, hopefully. Uh, we were hoping to go to Ikea, but because of lockdown, not sure if that's going to happen as soon as we'd like to, but we are gonna obviously be getting some stuff for the new place um, as you do. And I'll be sure to bring you along for that. Because there's not much going on right now uh, in terms of travel and stuff like that and actually being able to do things, today's video is gonna be a little bit different. I'm going to tell you about some of my favorite things reflect on some of my favorite places in Aachen, um, some of my favorite areas, kind of looking back at some of the old videos that I did, um, just things that I really enjoyed about Aachen and living in this area since we are moving. And let's get right into it. By far, my very favorite place in Aachen is the city center. Um, and this is most easily defined by the Rathaus or the city hall, I guess we could say. Um, it's just always really lively. It's a very large square with a beautiful city hall building. Um, this is also where the main touristic attraction, I guess you could say, is in the city. It's the dome or the major church from Charlemagne. Um, it's just a really nice area. It's always busy. It's filled with cafes and there's a lot of little shops. And Aachen's a very small city, so you can really walk from one end to the other without a problem. Um, I really like this area. I think it's... Um, Probably my favorite, definitely if I'm meeting with friends, I say let's meet there and then we can decide where we go from, from there. I also like the different parks that are in Aachen. There is um, three main parks that I can think of right now. There is uh, West Park, which is kind of like by the university like student area where the student housing is. I mean, it's all over the city, but um, this is a major area for it, West Park, and there's always a lot of people, especially in the summer, doing barbecues and that kind of thing. Um, another park I really like is called Hangweiler, and it has like a big, well, not really big, it has a big pond. Okay, it has a big pond in it, and there's paddle boats there, and there's cafe there, and people are always just enjoying the weather there. It's really nice. There's a trail that goes along the, the pond, and I think it's really pretty and there's a lot of ducks and stuff like that. Um, and then the third park that I really enjoy is called Kerr Garden. And Kerr Garden is near like a health center, which is where it gets its name from, I believe. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments below, but I'm pretty sure that's where it comes from. And I really like this park. I mean, it's very, very large and there's a lot of different parts to it, um, but it has, you know, different areas. It has nice trees and all these parks, of course, have um, playgrounds. They're just nice parks, they're always busy, uh, which is what I really like about them. The next thing I'm gonna mention is kind of a love-hate relationship about Aachen is um, there are a limited number of bars or restaurants with patios and stuff like that that you could sit outside. I'm not sure if it's just because of Corona, maybe there would have been more, but in the summer especially, it's almost impossible to find a table somewhere if you don't leave like right on time, if you're 
wanting to actually go out like at the popular time it's so hard to find a table for people so that's something that I kind of liked but also didn't like on the one hand it's really nice that it's so busy and people are always out and about but on the other hand it's kind of annoying when you're trying to find a table especially for like a small group of four people so it can be annoying um, that being said a helpful hint to anyone who's in Aachen is having this problem is that um, if you like, if you want to just meet up with friends and have a drink, you always just get a drink from the kiosk. And there's actually a lot of people, especially in their like, I wanna say 20s to 30s-ish. Um, a lot of people who just sit behind the rat house. There's a large staircase, like a really, really large staircase. And you can sit there and people are playing games, listening to music in their little groups. I mean, anyone's more than welcome to bring their own stuff and kind of make a little bit of a meetup there. Uh, which is really really popular in the summer but popular enough that you can actually find a space and of course this is totally allowed you are allowed to um, picnic in public you could say in Aachen in uh, Germany the last thing I would say that I really liked about Aachen is that the people here were really really friendly you often hear about people having a really difficult time making friends when they move to Germany um, but we did not have that problem. Obviously, we had a lot of international friends from different countries, but we also did make a lot of German friends and we had no problem. People in Aachen were really nice uh, for the most part. People were very friendly, didn't really bother you. We never had any problems with our neighbors. Our neighbors were always awesome. Um, so we're really, really happy about that. So even though we're excited to move to Frankfurt, we are really gonna miss Aachen. I'm gonna miss this apartment, miss the yard. I'm going to miss these parks that we've been to. I'm going to miss the lively neighborhoods. I'm sure that we're going to find similar or the same things in Frankfurt. Um, but of course, we're going to miss it. It was our first experience here living together. And we're really grateful for it. And we really hope that you enjoyed seeing Aachen. And if you did, and if you want to learn more, like look at more. I have so many videos. We've lived here for a year. Um, Check them out see what else we did around Aachen. I would definitely come back like I would definitely come back to visit I think there's still lots of stuff that because of corona we haven't been able to do we didn't go to any of the museums the only real interior thing that we did was to go inside the church um, just to see what it looked like inside so there's still so much left for us to do here and we'll for sure come back come back to check it out so I really hope you enjoyed today's video um, sorry again for not posting so much you know it's really been busy I'll try and post more but I don't want to post things just to post things. I don't, I didn't really have anything interesting to talk about unless you're really interested in hearing about doing your taxes in Germany, which uh, I don't want to, <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. That's how boring it is. Um, yeah, so hope you have a really nice Saturday and I'll see you in next week's video. Bye now.